In under two minutes, I'm going to teach you how to properly load and light a beekeeping smoker so that it will not go out on you. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put some wanted up paper in the bottom and get that lit. Now, if you are thinking of becoming a beekeeper or have ever struggled to keep a lit smoker, it is harder than it seems like it would be until you know what you're doing. So save this, text it to yourself, share and like and follow this page for more beekeeping tips but this is what you're going to do and this is the absolute best way to load a beekeeping smoker i have been beekeeping my entire life and this is absolutely the best way you're going to start with paper in the bottom then you're going to put a layer of pine shavings you can get a big bale of this from any livestock supply store that will last you forever then you're going to layer it with pine pellets. They use these for horse stalls, but they last forever. Beekeeping supply stores actually sell these pine pellets in small bags for a lot more expensive of a price. Save yourself some money and some time and go get a big bag of them. They're identical to the ones from beekeeping supply stores. They're horse pine pellets. There's, or sometimes they call them stall pellets. Anyway, so you're going to layer, light your paper, pine flakes then pine pellets then more pine flakes more pine pellets and you're just going to keep layering depending on how many hives you have and if you only have a few hives to work only fill us about a third of the way but if you're like me and you have 20 to 30 then you're going to load this all the way up and always buy a tall smoker not a short smoker happy beekeeping